Mikey, you shot 60% from the field. How were you able to get the looks you wanted? Um, I just found myself in a better rhythm. Um, you know, my teammates were staying on me to uh, take shots that I normally take, and today uh, they were falling. Coach, short time, sir. <laughs> Coach, what got the team to a great first half, and what was detailed halftime to put away in the second half? Um, before I answer that, I just wanna say um, a shout out to to Annie Shea. She's in the hospital. She's recovering. So I hope you're doing well, Annie. Um, we, um, we 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 wanted to have a, a good start uh, today, and we talked about not giving them a chance at the beginning. Um, we talked about um, them uh, playing on a back-to-back -back game, so we should have better energy. And I think we accomplished that. And um, I we have. We ha had 68 points in the first half, and they only had, um, I think, 40-something um, points. So um, I was happy about our first half, and it's because of our defense. Now we open the floor to our friends from the press. <laughs> what happened? Um, I think Jalen is aware that he can get a good shot anytime he wants. Um, it's only when I get frustrated that he sometimes um, gets to the basket and um, he was a bit out of control. And I told him that, hey, you can you can get the shots anytime anytime you want, and especially if going to the basket. Um, for as long as you stay un under control, you can actually finish um, shots around around the basket. We have a lot of players who can score, and one of them is right here on my side. And sometimes Mikey even passes up a lot of, of opportunities, which I, frustrates me sometimes. But I want him to be more aggressive, and the rest of the other guys, they, they are skilled. We have Roger, and of course Jalen there, and, and Jason, and even Kelly is contrib contributing. And um, Anybody can score um, for as long as we share the ball, and we are gonna get good looks. If we get good looks, then I think we can we can finish shots. Mike, what about you? What's your assessment on the team's offense so far the past few days? Um, I think we're finding a, a pretty good flow and chemistry together right now. Um, we're just finding ways to pick and choose our spots, but getting everybody in their strongest suits. Um, I think moving forward, that's gonna be our uh, our strength. Um, just finding ways to get people in good spots and. We, we knew that he was going to make shots even if it was contested and we were okay with that and um, we, we changed it a little bit in terms of we just don't want him to, to get his groove by dribbling left and right so that's one of our uh, main keys for tonight. But you know, a score you can always score, and Jordan is a, is a really good player, and so we were okay if he makes shots, even if it was contested. Uh, coach, speaking of Jordan Williams, of course you guys have Jalen Hurts. Personally, where do you think Jalen ranks among all of the reports so far? In the I think he's right up there. Top two. You know, yeah. Top two. He's not bad. <laughs> he's not bad. <laughs> Uh, I wouldn't say that. Brownlee is still the yardstick. That's it for our post-game press con. Thank you, gentlemen, and congratulations. Thank you.